the direct uh, answer of Arabs from these cities, from the inside of Israel, is that we feel that this is our place. We have nowhere else to go. We should think about the next day while when, when this war will be finished. And we have nowhere else to go. Jews and Arabs together, we will stay here. We will have to live with each, with each other. So why not be... Pragmatic mm-hmm. and logical, and and to uh, to uh, understand from the lessons from the past, because you know May 21, uh, we had clashes, violence, racism, uh, uh, all over the country, especially here in Jaffa, right. where Arabs and Jews were. You know, hitting each other, lynch attempts were, were were done, and this time we're doing all we can to prevent all these things and to stay the situation calm as much as possible. And this is one of the things that we are working on. Me and my colleagues are, are having an initiative which is called the Israeli, the the, the Jewish Arab um, um, uh, Partnership uh, Guard, which is we are trying to work together, Jews and Arabs that lives in Jaffa specifically but yeah. in Tel Aviv Jaffa in general to 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 keep each other's back to secure our our children and our houses and our synagogues and mosques and churches and to speak that we are here to to stay together and to see how can we help each other with no regards to our religion so this is why we install a uh, um, uh, hot line that yes. can accept mm-hmm. all kinds of help demands uh, in both languages, Arab, uh, Hebrew and Arabic, 24 hours, seven, seven, a week, seven days a week. And we are having more than 3,500 volunteers that are taking part with this initiative. Sure that this, this sense of security will be reassured from, from the people who are actually living uh, t- uh, together. Uh, um, Amir Badran, uh, before we unfortunately need to wrap up, how do we make sure, you know what, are you optimistic? This is my question to you. Well, you know, I, I, I won't really to keep up and keep continuing being optimistic, but I have to be realistic. Mm. So what I'm doing is I'm moving step by step. Each night, I'm really scared. And the next day when I, when I, when I open my eyes, it's 6.15 in the morning, and I open the TV to, her, to hear the news, and if everything's okay, I say, oh, my God. Yeah. We had another night. And, and just this passing is, it literally day by day, night by little night. By little. And, I'm, and, I, and I'm, I'm, I hope that things will get better. We need to have hope. We need to have more um, um, uh, together things that we yeah. should should be done Not as Jews and Arabs. This is the time. This is the time, this this is the time is the to time. do it. Uh, we cannot miss uh, this opportunity to be able to live together. Um, Amir Badran, thank you very much for thank coming you, here in studio.